Hey, our friends, we're gonna draw a little cute fish today that lost his dad, right, Hans? Mm -hmm. What's his name? Nemo. All right, you got your marker. Yes. We hope you guys are gonna follow along with us. You have something to draw with and a piece of paper in front of you. And we're gonna try and keep this nice and simple, right, Hans? Mm -hmm. All right, you ready to start? Yes. Okay, Hats, we're gonna start with Nemo's eyes, and we're gonna draw them kind of cartoonish, so we're gonna just draw a circle right in the middle of our paper, okay? So here we go, we're gonna draw, and it's gonna be kind of big, so we're gonna draw big eyes like that. So draw it right here, right in the middle of the paper. Good. Okay, so we could draw that a little bit bigger, but let's use that for the inside of his eye, okay? okay. So I'm gonna draw the circle that you drew. Here we go. I'm gonna draw one more circle. So let's pretend that that's what you drew. And then we're gonna draw another circle right inside that. So you can draw a little circle right there. And that way your Nemo is a little bit bigger. And then we're gonna color in this eye, except for the little circle. Good job. Good job, Hads. Okay, now you can draw the other, this bigger circle around that one, okay? Good job, that's really big. Okay, now we're gonna draw his other eye and we want this one to be about the same size over here, okay? So I'm gonna draw another eye right next to this one. And it's about the same size, squeaky marker. So we could draw another circle right there, okay? <laughs> Good job. Okay, now we're gonna draw the inside of his eye just like we did on the other eye, okay? So we're going to draw a circle, and then a little circle, and then color it in. Perfect! You did it! Okay, now let's draw his body. And his body's kind of tricky, but we can do it nice and simple, okay? So we're going to draw a big C shape that's going to go around his eyes, okay? So we're going to start over here, and maybe I'll put a dot for you, okay? So I'm going to do a dot right here for me, and that's where we're going to start. And then I'm going to do another dot down here where we're going to end. And that's going to be for our C shape, okay? I'm going to move this dot a little bit closer in. And that's where we're going to start. So here we go. We'll put one dot right here. And this is where we're going to start. And we're going to go all the way over to here. And then we're going to come back around and end right there. Go ahead and watch me first. And then you can do yours, okay? So we're going to do a big, a big rainbow line that comes over. And it's gonna stop right in his eye, right here, or touch it, and then we can keep going over to this side. And then we're gonna end right there. Okay? So you can drop over to here, and then you can end right there, and then come back around and end right there. So big C shape. Let's do that. We can do that one more time. Okay, Hads? So we're going to come up. We're going to do a big rainbow line that comes over here. That's okay. We're practicing, right? Mm -hmm. So we'll do a big, we're doing a big C shape. There we go. Good job. That looks awesome. Okay, and then come back down and we'll do a big C shape down here. Perfect. Give me five. You did it. <laughs> All right, let's do some eyebrows, okay? So we'll do a little curved line right here for one eyebrow and another curved line right here for his other eyebrow. You can do that right there. A little curve line, curve line right there. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay, now let's do a smile. He's got a really cute smile. It's right here. And we're going to do it off to the side, okay? So do a little smile right there. Good. And then let's draw the bottom of his smile. Like that. Good. And then let's draw his little tongue in there. <laughs> Good job, Ads. All right, Kay, should we draw some fins? Yes. All right, he doesn't look like a fish yet, huh? Mm -mm. No, he needs a fin. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna draw we're gonna draw a big U shape that's kind of on its side. That's gonna come out, up, and then back in like that. And that's for his side fin. Okay, so we draw a little U shape right here. So we can start right there. Come around and then back to that one. A big shape like this. That's for his good fin. Yes. Okay, now we need to draw his lucky fin, huh? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna draw just a little hook that comes out like here. 
comes out right over here on this side of his face. Good. And then he's got a little nick that comes out of it. So upside down U or V. Good. And then let's come back in like this. There's Lucky Finn. Perfect heads. Good job. Okay, now let's draw the little texture that's on his fin, okay? So we can draw a little line that curves out like this. Good. And then we draw a little line that comes out there. Yes. And then another line that comes off that one. There's his lucky fin. <laughs> okay, now let's draw a little curve. We're going to imagine this line right here from his body coming through his fin and coming up here. Like it's going to connect into that line. So we're going to start right there and then end right there. And that's to finish his body. Good. And you just connect those two dots right there. There you go. Okay, now we're going to draw his tail fin. So we're going to draw a curve that comes out of this side. So we're, we'll draw it kind of one step at a time. So we're going to curve up to there. Little curve. Good. And then we're going to draw another curve over here on this side. Like that. So we can draw a little curve that comes from there and kind of connects to this. Good job. Okay, now let's let's make his tail. So we're gonna curve around this and into that. So we're gonna connect this line, come all the way around, and then connect into there. So we'll start up here. We can start up here and then curve down and into there. Yes, good job. Okay, now let's draw the top fin. So we're gonna start right here in between his eyes. We're gonna draw a little line that comes up and hooks down. So we're gonna draw a hook, up and hook. Good, and then we'll draw another up and hook, like that. Good, then we're gonna draw another hook, but this one's gonna come up a lot higher, like this, and then back down. So we're going to draw another one that comes, a big rainbow line that comes up and ends right there. Good. And then we'll draw another one that comes down, another rainbow line that comes like that. We'll start right here and then we can come back up and then back down. Yep. And then back down. Good. You did it. Okay. Now he's got a couple fins down at the bottom. Okay, so we'll draw a little U shape right here, right here at the bottom, little U. Good, and then let's draw another U right next to it, like that. Perfect, we did it. So he doesn't quite look like Nemo yet because he still needs some stripes, huh? Because mm -hmm. he's a clownfish? Yeah. Yes, and so we need some stripes. So let's start on his tail, okay? So we're going to draw another line like this on his, well, not on his tail, on his fin. So draw another line right here, okay? Right next to it. He's looking so cute. And then we can color this in. Let's color his, his fin, this side of his fin in. Good job. Okay, now let's do little stripes on his, on his fin. So we can do a little spike here. We'll do another spike, and then, and then we'll do another spike, and another spike down his his fin. So we can turn the paper like this, and we can do four little spikes. Okay. Okay. Yes, and then two more. One. Two. Good job. All right, Kate, we can turn our paper back this way. And then let's do another stripe on the top of this fin. So we're going to do a, a line that comes just like we did over here. See how we do it right next to the one that we already drew? Mm-hmm. Like that. You know what we're going to do? I changed my mind. So I'll go ahead and finish this. And then I'm going to show you a little easier way that we can color it because we're using our marker. And we can color him a lot easier if we use our oil pastels, okay? Okay. So I'm going to finish this part, and then we'll do the rest of him with our color or with our oil pastels, okay? Okay. 
Okay, heads, I went ahead and finished his, his fins, and we're gonna use the oil pastels to finish yours, okay? okay. So we're gonna start with our black. We have orange, black, and red are the only colors we're gonna use. We're gonna start with black. And we're gonna put the stripes down his side of his body, okay? So we're gonna start up here, and we're gonna do kind of a backwards C shape. So I'll show you mine first. We're gonna start right next to his eyes, and we'll come down here, and we're gonna do a big C shape that goes into his, his belly down here. So we'll start up here, do a big C shape that comes all the way around down here and ends right there, okay? okay. Good job. And then you can do it a couple times so that it looks a little darker. Okay. Awesome. Good job, Ads. Okay, now we're going to do another stripe right next to that one. We'll do another stripe that comes down like that. We'll do the same thing right next to it. Perfect. Good job. You can do a little darker. Awesome. Okay, now I'm going to put one more over here so that I can kind of connect for his body. He's got another stripe in there. And you can do two more in there. You want to do two more? Because he's got two white stripes. So you can do another one right here down to his fin. I kind of ran out of room. There we go. You're going to make that a little darker. Good job. All right, Hads. Okay, now let's get our orange. And we're going to color everything except for the two white stripes. So this is a white stripe, and this one's a white stripe. So you can color right here in between this one. And then we're gonna color his fins here, here, and his body, okay? And his fins right here. And you, this one? Um, this one's white, so we're gonna leave that one white. Okay. Okay, you ready? Should we fast forward? Yeah. All right, let's do it right I now. Can. Good job, Hads. Okay, now we need to finish the stripes on his tail. So you can get your black marker, or your black uh, oil pastel, and do a little thick line that goes around the top of his, the top of his fin up there. See, that's a lot easier, huh? Mm -hmm. If we use the oil pastels instead of the marker. So go ahead and, and do that, we can fast forward. Okay. Okay, now we can do another strip on this one, on his tail. So you do a little line right here, and then you can color that one in too. There you go. Perfect. And then color that in. Good job. Okay, and then you can do another thick one down here on his little tails, on his little fins down here at the bottom. Good job. And then the other one too. Perfect. And then let's do the little spikes on his fin. So we can do little lines that come up into his fin that make him look more like a fish, huh? Good job. We can do a couple more. And then you can do some on his tail over here on this side. Awesome, Hads, look at that. You did such a good job. Did you have fun? Yeah. You promise? Mm -hmm. We hope you guys had fun drawing your cute little Nemos with us, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Bye. You did such a good job. Mwah.